Hi, my name is Steve and I'm going to go over my beard routine for you today. I'm going to do a little bit of blow drying. Uh, I start off with a damp, wet beard, usually out of the shower, picking out all the, any knots that I have in the beard, uh, just going through it. And then uh, I just grab a, I grab a brush, just the same thing there. My, my beard is still wet, still damp. I lose like at least a dozen or two hairs every time I put a comb through it. It's kind of a sad day actually every time. So I like to use low heat and low speed. I like to do the bottom first. Um, that way there's something for the beard, the front of the beard to fall onto. So I'll, uh, I'll get this thing kicked off. So low. So with my beard, I've got a lot of um, the wings right here. Uh, I like to take care of them, make them a little bit puffy. So what I do is I just pull it out, uh, always create tension with the heat, and you should be good to go. For me, I get this little dent in here that I, I try to get out. So again, with tension and heat, you just take it, pull it out with the, with the tension and the heat. Once that's good, I just go through the top, go from uh, side to center, side to center. That's the blow dryer. I'll use it again here in a second, but uh, now it's time for the good stuff. So my beard's a little thick, a little dense. So I get my, I'm using the, uh, the gunslinger today. Good stuff. It smells great too. Now that's all over my hand. I just generously apply <laughs> oil. Um, but for me with my beard, since it's longer, a little bit thicker, a lot of my, the density of my beard comes from the throat. And so it's hard for me to get my fingers up into the beard uh, or up into my skin because we all know that this, the oil is for the skin. And so for me to do that and get the oil in there, it doesn't really get where it needs to go. So what I do is I kind of use it like a paintbrush. I use, I use a pick and uh, I, just, I just dip it in there like it's a paintbrush. And you can actually feel it. Like it's probably better than your fingers anyway, but uh, nice and you can get it where you need it, where you want it. So after the oil, put the butter in. Not much, just a little bit will do, but. I could go like this, or what I like to do is I like to hit it one more time. And this time what I do is I, uh, I usually take a, uh, my live bearded boar bristle brush and uh, this time we're gonna do cold heat. If you have a cold setting, it's great. But more of a, like a set blow, I guess is what you could call it. After that, I just brush it through make it look how I want it for the rest of the day, and I'm good.